Hello there, printer manufacturers increasingly are using setup cartridges as a means to initialise a printer. What do we mean by that? If you take a look at a cartridge, you'll see setup clearly written on the cartridge. What this does, once you put these cartridges in, and then you take them out and put another set of cartridges in, the printer will no longer recognise those cartridges or any other setup cartridges. Now as a specialised printer sales company who remove cartridges and replace them with dye sublimation and other cartridges or edible cartridges, we have an abundance of these in stock. So how do we make these genuine cartridges that work every time? It's quite simple. You can see the chip here on the printer. It's this that the printer is reading. So if we remove that billy do, and all we do is just pop our Stanley knife under very carefully without ripping our fingers off. Like that. And as you can see, that chip has come off. Honest, it has. It wants to be awkward, but that's my problem. So there we go, the chip's off. So what we're going to do is to take one of our replacement magenta chips here shim up and click it on there you go that cartridge is, a, is the equivalent of a genuine Epson magenta cartridge it will work, it serves the same capacity, it will work in exactly the same way however your printer may say that it's a non-genuine owing to the chip okay, thanks for that